But I went through last night to try to find a couple of examples because I think it may illustrate it better than my poor description of it. Um, this is uh, page 43. It's a March 22nd, 1973 uh, tape. And on this left-hand side, we have the House Judiciary Committee transcripts. And I always saw them as the, as the tapes that had come from the grand jury. And then we made them. And I know you've interviewed people who have made these. And then this is the White House transcript, what I call the blue volume. So um, there, there's a, and it gives you the exact pages. And the members of the uh, House Judiciary Committee both, and eventually the members of the House of Representatives could go and listen to the tape. So they could take this or take whatever. And so uh, here's an example of where um, in the White House transcripts, the ones that were doctored, I'm going to use that word now, but you always use the word edited then, um, the president is um, quoted as saying, well, all along, John Mitchell is arguing that is how we use flexibility in order to get off the cover-up plan. So he puts the words in John Mitchell's mouth, but he says in order to get off the cover-up plan. If you go to the House Judiciary Committee uh, version, the president says, but now what all that John Mitchell is arguing then is that now we, we use flexibility John Dean says that's correct, and the president says, in order to get on with the cover-up plan. Now, if that's buried in a transcript, you're never going to see that. A lot of people would argue that, well, in order to get off the cover-up plan is pretty damning, even in John Mitchell's mouth, he puts the words. But this is much more damning. And so what we did and we, is that you can see in this version, we, we released it like this. And so it was perfect for television. So they were released um, on 7-9, um, 1974. And the news on 7-10, 1974, the reporters took all this and they made uh, demonstrations, uh, uh, exhibits, 